Hello viewers. Welcome to the channel Amazing Civil Engineering Studies. Time to enter the world of civil engineering. Here we will learn about different concepts related to civil engineering. Please subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon for more new updates. In today's video we are going to discuss about how to design footing for G plus 1 domestic building. In this video we will learn about the designing of footing for ground plus first floor. Here we are not going to use any standard codes. This is just a basic thing which can be used by anybody. A technical or non-technical person want to construct a G plus 1 building. Here we will see some basic points which must be keep in mind for every civil engineer which constructing a building. Here we will see how to construct a footing, its dimensions, spacing and many more. Point 1 for single-story G plus 1 building, where the soil safe bearing capacity is 30,000 kg M2. An oncoming load on the column does not exceed 30 tons. As per my knowledge. Point 2. Footing size should be 1 METER times 1 meter. Point 3. Depth should be 1,200 mm or 1.2 m, below the ground level. Note it is recommended to go to depth up to hard strata. Whenever we are excavating for depth of foundation or footing, try to reach to the hard strata. Point 4. Steel reinforcement details on the footing. Use 12 mm diameter steel, for both main bar and distribution bar. Provide the minimum spacing of 150 mm or 6 inches. Point 5. Do 150 mm PCC, plain cement concrete, in first layer, over then provide steel mesh on that with the depth of 200 mm minimum, but as per recommendation do it 300 mm. Point 6. Use minimum M20 grade of concrete. For residential building we can use a minimum of M20 grade of concrete G plus 1 residential buildings. The ratio of M20 grade concrete is 1, 1 1.5, 3. If you follow all those above steps, Anyone having civil technical knowledge or anyone having no such knowledge can easily construct a beam, and the structure will never fails. Few things we have to remember, if the bearing capacity of the soil is less then we have to increase the depth of the foundation and also changes the size of the footing and also making changes in reinforcement details. Thanks for watching. For now, please subscribe, like, share and do not forget to press bell icon.